My name is Chasen. I was born in Thailand, Opia, a refugee camp, but my parents, sister, and grandparents were born in Burma. Because the DKPA burned down the village, my parents, sister, and grandparents have to move to North Thailand, Opia, a refugee camp. In 1999, while my mother and family were escaping, I was in her room. When I lived in Thailand, I did not get enough education. I was only in first grade when my mom decided that she wanted to move to the United States. Before the day that we were supposed to come to America, we celebrate. All my friends and my mom's friends came to celebrate with us. After we eat, me and my friends, we play jump rope, and my mom and her friend talk and laugh. We had so much fun. The next morning on April 29, 2008, we woke up early at 6 a.m., got ready and went down to the front of the road to wait for the taxi. When I was in the taxi from Tanya to Mesa, I felt really dizzy because I had never ridden in a taxi before. We stayed at Mesa for five hours. While we were there, I saw people selling food by the side of the street and it smelled so sweet. So Mama bought me and my sister meatball. After five hours of waiting, we got on a double-decker bus that took us to Bangkok. We waited at Bangkok for an hour. While we were there, we saw a lot of refugee families waiting for taxi. The people who work at Bangkok Hotel gave us rice soup to eat. It tasted so delicious. Then we got on a plane and flew to New York. On the plane, I was really tired. So I fell asleep, and when I woke up, I saw food on the table in front of me. Then I tried the food, and it tasted disgusting. When we got to New York, we got on another plane and flew to Georgia. We landed in Hearts Bay, Jackson, Atlanta International Airport. When we got off the plane, we saw our case walker. She took us to our apartment. It was so big. While I was there in Georgia, I was really happy that we got to live in a big apartment that was make, made out of strong brick instead of bamboo and leaf. Inside of our apartment, there were three big rooms, and in the fridge, there were fried rice and chicken wing. After living in Georgia for three years, my mom decided to move to Minnesota because we don't have good medication in Georgia. Now in Minnesota, I have a good opportunity to, to get education and a better life.